So apparently I just did a take of this completely unaware that the camera was not rolling. Uh, so anyway, <laughs> from the top, uh, I'm going through uh, the news today and I found this post from 2014 and it's entitled, quote, where do programmers work? Help us show or help us show the world. And what it is, is it is a look from 2014 uh into the world and the lives of computer programmers of that particular day and age and uh it's it's done by a group called or a, a a show called the media show which i've heard good things about i've never actually seen the media show um so let, let's just read a little bit of it to give you an idea of what they're trying to ask for here quote for the media show's current season we are answering questions that people ask google about the media and technology We've been finding these through search autocompletes. We start by typing something like, why does TV dot, 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 and let Google tell us a lot about how people finish their sentence. And they show two pictures. One, a uh, programming workplace in circa 1940s, uh, which is a bunch of women in long dresses plugging cables into some kind of electronic data processing machine uh, that looks very much like something you'd expect out of the 1940s. And then, quote, as seen by the UK media in early 2000s, which I think is a sh shot from The Office, um, which is the, the shot is a basement-esque uh, programmer uh, office with a couple of geeks in it, uh, with a desktop monitor, et cetera. So as you can imagine, the two pictures of what computer programmers do uh, from 2000 versus 1940s are completely different just absolutely different. Um, and so the, the idea being is that um, it, it's just showing that something has changed here. And what I find interesting here is this post is from 2014. So that's five years ago now. So things have changed since this post was made. And so uh, I, I, maybe they made a collage or maybe they made a video or whatever they made from this post uh, is already starting to probably be a little bit dated. So let's continue reading a little bit. Okay, uh, quote, question we found people asking is, where do computer programmers work? And we want your help in answering this one, because the best way to explain it is to show it. And we want to show as many kinds of people as we can programming. People of color, queer and trans folks, men and women, older and younger folks, people with disabilities, people with tiny kids running around them while they code, people at urban cafes, people at rural areas, non-traditional workspaces, and unusual applications of programming. So here's what we want you to do. No, stop for a moment because, hey, they probably did something with all these shots that people sent in. But again, this is five years ago. Things have changed. It is now time to relook at this. So what I would suggest, if you're seeing this video right now, let's do this again. Let's let's retake these videos. Let's see what the world around you uh, is it looks like as a computer programmer. So let, let's go to their suggestions and see what they suggest. So quote, make an extremely short snippet of video, no more than 15 seconds tops, showing you as a programmer and where you work. Say your name, sentence about what you code, and I work here in blank location. Uh, mention where you're from originally, if you'd like. Uh, and then two, if your first language is something other than English, great, go ahead and say this in your language if you'd like. Three, uh, give us a nice view of your workspace as well as you. Is it a cafe, a school, your kitchen, outdoors, an office full of cubicles, a hacker space, etc.? We'd also be happy to see your coworkers. Obviously, get their permission. Uh, they suggest to shoot in landscape, not portrait. I don't think that part's all that important in 2019. Uh, try to not have any music in the background. Certainly don't add any music or special effects. Uh, lighting should be good enough that we can see your face and the space around you. And then two, upload to YouTube. And then they have some other ideas of, you know, contact them or whatever, but that, that, that part's not important. If what I would suggest is if you're a computer programmer and you're seeing this video, record, record your own video and, and show the world just a little glimpse into like 10 to 15 second glimpse into what it looks like in your workspace right now. Uh, and let's, let's replicate this. Um, now, obviously, this video is a little bit longer than 10, 15 seconds because I have to give you the instructions of what to do. Uh, but uh, my name is Jeff Cliff, and this is my my workspace. I uh, live in an apartment and have my desktop computer here where I spend most of my time on. Uh, it's a little bit glary with the, the screen, but I have my little bit of a messy desk here. And uh, I have 
a little desktop and computer that does some of the heavy lifting. And then under this desk, it's kind of hard to tell, there's another desktop computer. And then unfortunately you can't see the laptop that's taking this, but there is a laptop behind you. Um, and uh, so this is where I spend most of my time in this cold uh, kind of quasi messy apartment. And uh, hopefully you enjoy this video. Uh, and uh, yeah, if, if you're a computer programmer and that might mean, you know, whether or not you do free software or God forbid proprietary software development, uh, or e even if you, you know, just uh, do it kind of as a side uh, gig or like something on the side. As long as you do computer programming, take a video, see what your world looks like, show the rest of us and the future what your workspace looks like. And then let's uh, put all these together. And uh, once you've made your video and uploaded it to DTube or YouTube or whatever Google alternative you have, uh, send a, or post a link in the, the comments of this uh, video. And uh, we'll see if we can get them all together. So hopefully you enjoyed this video and hopefully you uh, record a video of your own and share it. See your videos soon.